I'm gonna be doing chicken chamay. So before I start, I'm gonna mix up the ingredient first. Make sure they are all set. So first of all, I'm yeah. going to cook my maggi. It's, it's optional. It's depending on people's choice. You know, I'm gonna put in my maggi, my maggi kit here. Look at this. I'm gonna put this one here. I will mix. Sauce in there. Is in there. My soy sauce. Just me six sauce. Yes. Just me see. Yeah. I'm gonna be putting my oyster sauce in there. Okay. Okay. Then I'm gonna be putting my plum sauce. This plum sauce is optional. Just you know, want wanted to get a different flavor. So there are different things people put when they cook that. They just put oyster yes, sauce. So I'm gonna put a uh, Worcester sauce, Worcester shell sauce. You know, I'm gonna put put in a um, soy sauce, light soy sauce. Okay, this is the light soy sauce. So I'm gonna go in there. Okay, and dark soy sauce. They got light one. They got um, they got a. Uh, dark one they got light one so i like to miss both on okay it's optional you can use one you don't have to use both okay guys that is it yeah light soy sauce can you see it so i'm gonna tip it in there okay goes in there then some people use sugar you know, because I'm health conscious, I'm going to be put, tipping in my honey. Okay, my honey goes in there. Then my chili powder, because we like hot food, it's optional. People don't put chili, you know Africa with chili. So I'm tipping in my chili powder in there, okay? My chili powder goes in there, okay? That is my chili powder. You can put fresh, then I'm going to stir, okay? But my water has been boiling. Okay, I'm gonna just um, put in my egg noodles. Okay, fine egg noodles gonna go in there. You know, boil it for like um, one minute or a few seconds. You don't have to overcook it, it's just to soften it. Then I'm gonna bring it out. Okay, I'm going to bring it out and use cold water to bind it and let it cool down two will be enough we got like six packets in there that's what it says there fine egg noodles guys that is the noodles the egg noodles yeah so i'm gonna put it in here and you see it oh it's piping hot man oh look at so i'm gonna cool it down with cold water so they don't so they don't stick i'm gonna go in this cool water so they don't stick okay These are the ingredients I'm using. That is chopped carrots. That is uh, green red pepper, red bell pepper, and green red bell pepper. That is my onions. That is my garlic. That is my spring onions chopped in there. Okay, they are already. Okay, guys, you can put yellow pepper. Put any vegetable you fancy. Okay, you don't have to be my own way. All right. So that is my bean sprout. If you like, it's optional. You can put bean sprout. This bean sprout, you can eat it on its own like that. You can put it in your salad. You know? So that is my noodles. My, my egg noodles. You know, you need to dry them. When you wash them, I dry it with a kitchen paper towel, okay? They are all dry and are ready to be cooked. That is my work on the fire. So this is the chicken I'm going to be using, but I will take off. I need just the breast, okay? And this is the prawn, king prawn, okay? No, this is not king prawn, just ordinary prawn, not the king one, okay? That's prawns. So I'm going to take out chicken from here. I'm going to just use the chicken breast, okay? We bought it to roast, but we changed mine now to use it to do chicken chame. So I'm going to be taking out the skin. I know how to butcher meat, you know? <laughs> and take the meat from here. 
see get some good chicken breast out from here for the chicken chairman okay guys that is it now been done so i'm gonna get some meat out of there so the work is on the fire and i'm gonna start tipping my oil okay that's my oil you can use any oil olive oil sesame seed oil as well if you want so that is the oil in there what i will do i'm gonna put in my chicken first to make sure the chicken is well cooked okay that is my chicken goes in there It goes in there. You can you can marinate your chicken with uh, the sesame seed, sesame seed oil, soy soya seed oil. You can marinate your chicken. I didn't marinate my chicken. I don't I don't want it this way. Okay, you can marinate it. So when you are cooking chicken chame or corn chame, you can marinate your chicken with a soya, soya, soya sauce, dark and light one, sesame seed, oil star, you know, marinate them for maybe 30 minutes, but I didn't marinate this one, okay guys? So we all cook differently, okay? Don't panic. You put your chicken first. This is the way I cook mine. There are various methods where you fry the chicken, push it aside, then you put the rest of, you know, just like that, okay? I put my car, uh, I'll let the meat cook first because it's chicken. The chicken, because it's chicken breast and it's cut finely and thin, it cooks very quick. It doesn't take time to cook, okay? So I'm going to tip in my, my carrots. Don't overcook it, okay? My carrot goes in there. The garlic has gone there with the onions. Okay, guys? So you can mix everything together now, okay? Incorporate everything together. See, there are various colors banging in there, okay? I'll put in my, my, my prawns in there, goes in there. If you like, you don't put prawns, just put all the chicken. Cook it with all the chicken like that, okay? Putting my prawns in there. I'll put in my sprouts, my bean sprouts, okay? Goes in there. They are very fast and handy to cook, very easy. The, the only place is chopping up the sweet pepper, the carrots, you know, that takes time, but the cooking doesn't take time. Five minutes is cooked, okay? So I'm going to be tipping in my noodles, tipping my noodles, okay, the noodles go in there, so I'm going to tip in my soy sauce, all the mixed ingredients in here, you know, they're going to go in there. gonna get some little water just to, to get them off from the top Chicken chame is ready. It's ready to be served. <laughs>